Hi, and welcome to States of Being. I'm LJ Jellison. So in the 10th episode, this is just one, live. So what we're going to do, live. But before we do that, I just want to recap the first nine episodes. So first, we're going to start with the basics. When you get a piece that you want to work with, listen to the words and find out what the song is saying. Then, sit and just let it move you. Find out what emotions and feelings come to the surface. Next one on top of that is you want to find a storyline. A simple storyline with characters and a setting. It's easier to be yourself when you have something to do than it is just to be yourself in your head. Number two, it's always best to find your improv. Find who you are as a dancer. This is the key. Improv is the key to finding who you are as a dancer. Number three, when you are improving, no critique. Don't critique yourself and don't let others critique you. This is your time, your voice. You are pushing the limits. You're establishing new emotions and new emotional notes for your repertoire. So let it all just sit as it is. Keep it nice and raw. Number four, do not hold yourself hostage. If you do not like something you do, move on. Accept it. We fall. It's part of life. We make mistakes. It's part of life. Just accept who you are. Number five, you are your own biggest enemy. So get out of your way. Don't let vanity stand in your way. It's not about what you look like. It's about what you have to say as an artist and as a dancer. So find your words, find the story you want to tell, and tell it full out. Number six, you are not just dancing. You are telling a story. And it's always important to tell a story. People love stories. The audience loves stories. It gives them something to attach to. It also gives you direction and a roadmap to go through. Number seven, do not be afraid of showing people who you are. It's the only thing you have is who you are. That's the only thing you own as a dancer. So strengthen it, flourish, and be who you are without any apologies. Number eight, live life without any apologies. This is the most important thing you can do as a dancer. Treat everything as a learning lesson. You find somebody who's better than you or you think is better than you, learn from them. You fall down, you learn from it. You make a mistake, you learn from it. The biggest thing that I can leave with you is treat everything like a learning experience. If you do so, you will accept everything into your life. It's the most important thing you can do as a dancer. Aaron and I want to thank you for joining us in States of Being. We hope that we have shared something with you that will allow you to find your voice, maybe help you find your voice as a dancer. It's the most important thing you have. I want to thank my wife Erin for helping me out. And we're going to leave you just having a good time. So on this last exercise, I want you to go in the studio, have a good time, show off. Don't be afraid of who you are. Don't be afraid of what you can do and don't apologize for it. Thank you. States of Being, I'm LJ Jellison.